Hi viewers, this is your host Girish and on today's travel guide we are going to explore Kottayam and Kumaragom. So guys, keep following me into the wonderful journey along with us only on your favorite channel Rose Ball only on the travel guide. Uh, we left from Kottayam railway station and currently we are in one of the lakes basically Kumaragam is part of uh, it's cons it consists of a lot of lakes which emerges into Vembanad Kayal we are trying to get on one of the houseboats just for you guys to experience what it feels like when we are in a houseboat as you can see behind me a row of houseboats are, houseboats are there and all of the water it emerges into Vembanad Kayal <coughs> Kumaragam is said to be around 5000 plus hectares of land. In that, more than 2400 hectares of land is lake areas. And Kumaragam, as we all know, is well below the mean sea level. So guys, let's move on and start our journey in one of the houseboats. Let's see which houseboat we can get in. So guys, follow me. So viewers, as I had promised you a house boat travel today, yeah, we are in Kumaragam and we are near uh, Kumaragam house boat holidays. We have Mr. Praveen with us. Hi, Praveen. And Mr. Praveen with us. He will be hosting us throughout our journey to the heart of Vembanad Kyle. Let's travel into uh, Kumaragam house boat holidays. Boat holidays, the, the company, and this boat's name is also Kumaragam House Boat. So you can see, I am not driving it. It's very risky out there, and it's very tough for me to handle. But as I am very experienced, I am trying it very hard. This house boat can cater up to two families, and uh, the cost can go up till it's uh, close to twelve thousand rupees. You can bargain it though. But it's twelve thousand rupees for two families, and the uh, journey begins at eleven thirty a.m. and it ends at the next day nine thirty a.m. The main uh, attraction of this package is like you get full holiday, uh, full package saying like uh, you get your breakfast, your lunch, your dinner, all are special Kerala treats. I got this as a complimentary. So guys, let's move on. I am driving very fast, especially we will go later inside and see what all facilities are there. To set sail uh, into the backwaters, into the straight into the heart of Kutanad from where we started. This is Mr. Dilip. I have over here an expert driver. Actually, I was driving it and then suddenly he came on side and like it's better that he drives it because they don't want a Titanic over here. So now they have given me, Mr. Dilip Chetan has given me the sail. Steering. Steering. The steering of the ship. And I am expertly driving it as you see. This is one of the features like when you come onto a private houseboat, especially in Kumaranga houseboat, they allow you to steer the wheels as, because this is a completely different experience. It's not like driving on a highway. It's not like you are in a car. Expertly see he is helping me because I am getting off from my track. So uh, in cities wherever we drive or in villages wherever we drive, there are traffics, there are roads both holes thanks to our government but here when it's like completely tranquility you are you are one with the nature and you feel it when you sit over here you feel it it's not raining right now i hope it was raining because if it rains the romance doubles so especially you come down over here 
ask them like if they can allow you to drive it especially if you have if you are a licensed driver like me they will allow you and make sure you along with your lover your couple if you are coming or your kids you have make sure you sit down over here spend some time behind the steering because as you see we are just in front of the boat and we can see like how how the water gets divided how the water gets divided if you stand over here it's like you are standing with kate winslet you feel like you are standing with kate winslet on a titanic boat i can really feel it awesome especially there are it's a bit risk but i'll go there there's two steps over here you stand over here awesome wow as you can see on my uh, left hand side it's uh, kumaragam bird sanctuary completely groves mangroves are there it's complete dense forest and on my right side it's a lagoon country lagoon on my left side you can see kumaragam bird sanctuary during your 22 hours of travel on this boat what they provide is a, is a complete package there are a lot of sightseeing you will go across the heart of alapura across some dams some sightseeing are there and then you can pass on to a smaller boats and touch all these mangroves so it's really wonderful i feel like i am i am entering into a sea through a river that's the place where we entered from it's like small branches Kumaragam village is close to 5000 hectares of land and out of that 5000 more than 2400 hectares of land is just lake just lake water it's part of kutanad which is way below the mean sea level so the place in our last episode where we went kulukumale it was 8500 feet above sea level and right now we are i don't know how much but we are minus sea level that's why it's called backwaters awesome As you guys know, Kerala and all of India has been experiencing heavy torrential rains during the last uh, two weeks. That's why over here also it has affected, and the water has risen close to two, three feet above what was it? Yeah, it actually was. And right now, where we are traveling, there are parts of lands. It's kind of island, and there's mud over there, and earth has been uh, in some places. It's like trenches, so you have to know your way well. just now my driver mr dilip told me he knows the way that's why he can drive it so easily right over there it's padira manal island no bus service is there actually if you want to go there you have to go by boats so we are trying to go as close as possible we don't have much time with us so we are trying to go as much close as possible we have to know the ways as well right uh, like i said it's a kind of island because there you see some patches of greenery you can see it's basically land so you have to know your way when you are driving Wow. have a look what kumaragam houseboat really has to offer in terms of our stay and the luxury amenities right now i am uh, entering into the dining area of kumaragam houseboat as you can see all the panels it's wooden it's completely traditional uh, traditional carpentry work that you can see over here in our traditional ancient kerala homes you can see this kind of seats 
especially the roofs how they have made it elaborated very well it's a very very good structure that we see over here and this room can see it up to you can say as you can see it's four people can see it right now but they can make it an arrangement for seven or eight or ten people at the single time you can have your dinner your lunch over here this is the main dining area and as you can see they have windows and doors on all the side it's climate control we have ac over here so during summer period if it's very hot you don't want to miss uh, the breeze yes for me i would never prefer them to turn on the ac and close all the doors because i'm coming down over here to get this same breeze this same feel but still if it's very hot you can use the ac now let's move on to see what they have to offer in terms of bedrooms and the kitchen facilities so we move on from here especially the door uh, while while having your snacks while having your lunch you can you can enjoy like you can sit down over here with your couple with your girlfriend or or your kids you can sit down over here enjoy the tranquility and have your food now we move move on to the interior especially the interiors also you can see it's wood carvings everywhere it's very well built i am told they spent close to 54 lakhs to make up this board and i can see why it cost so much see all the techniques so the first thing we come down over here is the first bedroom you can see i'm try I'll, i'll close it first just to show you this it's called manichitra tar basically you can see you can find it in old homes and all the doors have been very well built when you come inside it's a vast bedroom you won't believe you are standing inside a boat it feels like you are in some kind of hotel you have a very vast bedroom over here there's tv music system dvds for you to play and plus there's a mini bar or fridge facility there's nothing inside i was trying to find something this is the bathroom you can see this is also a luxury one completely tiled up and you have a small bathtub over here you can spend quality time if you are coming on for, for a honeymoon and all you know you can spend quality time and the doors very well built when you are standing inside you don't feel you are in a boat the first bedroom and then we have a common wash basin area over here just to wash your hands during your lunch and dinner time plus there's one more bedroom as i told you kumaragam houseboat holidays their boat it caters to two families at a time so that's for like uh, they don't want too much crowd to come in they don't want too much people so basically you are coming with your own family if you are on a honeymoon you can own it on your own and that will cost you around 8000 rupees they just told me but if two families are coming it's 12000 that's quite reasonable this is the second bedroom same thing you can find all the ceilings and all it's very very well built you have a feeling of staying inside a hotel right now we are traveling and i can feel a bit of uh, uneasiness because i'm not used to the kind of sea traveling and all but still it's very quiet very calm very slowly we are going we, we we can feel we can have that feel but yeah you are paying it to get that feel same thing we have a tv we have fridge a large bathroom for our use now let's go on to see how they maintain the kitchen we we have not told them we have coming because i want to see how hygienic it is now this i am entering into the kitchen area there are three staff members for our catering needs chandra bhai yes samju samju this is samju with us sojan sojan and one one guy is really busy over here chandra bhai sham 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 is there for all your needs he is busy in cutting inanda jangal kondi specially so kerala means kerala means so kerala means you get especially curry means and all when you come down over here alappuzha and kutanad is basically famous for curry mean the crabs different kind of river fishes you can try it over here and in kumaragam houseboat holidays they serve you pure kerala means so basically any part of india you are from any part of kerala you are from you are bound to like the taste as well so this is the kitchen space that we have a small but very neat very hygienic kitchen
are exactly in the heart of Kutanad, the Vembanad Lake. We are in Kumaragom, in the backwaters of Kerala, one of the finest backwaters of Kerala. Awesome to sit over here. Especially, I will suggest if you are coming with your family or with your on your honeymoon, make sure you have a glass of wine with you and your lover beside you. Or even if you are sitting alone, feel the breeze, the wind. I can feel it like when you are out in the ocean or in the sea. It's really salty. But right now we are in a lake. We are in a backwater. It's pure water that's flowing down. So there's no salt. You can easily sit down over here, have a glass of wine, look out onto the horizon. See the whole of Alapura and all. Enjoy your evening. I'm telling you, it's really worth it. You have to come down here at least once in your lifetime to enjoy this serene beauty. So, here we end our journey of Vembanad Lake. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I have enjoyed it. As part of our monsoon travel package, this is the best tourism spot I have come across. And especially when you are traveling to Kerala, make sure during a monsoon period you visit over here. The main peak season, they, as they told me, was December and January for foreigners because they come down over here on their entourage, on their way to Munnar and all. So it's convenient for them. But for us during the school holiday periods, we should make a point to come down over here enjoy the services i had preferred kumaragam holidays boat services so as you can see as i told you earlier i had a very good journey on to the lakes or uh, throughout uh Vembanad kyle and on the uh, i had seen the shores of alapura and all that and then i had a very good uh, warm atmosphere over here because they had a very good dining space over here they had two luxurious huge bedrooms and toilet attached and all their culinary needs all the kitchen services we had seen they have a special menu, especially for the uh, people who are coming outside Kerala and for the people who are inside Kerala. Because I told you, as I told you, curry mean the speciality and all the other food items. You have to come down and enjoy it over here. I enjoyed it a lot. So make sure whenever you are, uh, you have on your mind monsoon, make sure you come down onto Kumaragam, enjoy the boat services. And I, I would like to add. Kumaragam boats, uh, boat and holiday services, they have their own websites, they have uh, credit card facilities, they have online payment facilities, they have, uh, they can arrange uh, travels for you from uh, from Ernakulam airport or from Trivandrum airport if you are coming from or from the uh, uh, local railway stations, maybe from Kottayam, if you are travelling from Kottayam, if you are travelling from Ernakulam, they can arrange cab services for you as well. So, as much as I have enjoyed, I hope you have also enjoyed and if you want to enjoy it more, make sure you come down over here.